We should talk later, Havor. Racing against pigs. <laughs> yes! What is more amusing than watching drunken men race against pigs? <laughs> We've done worse things to entertain ourselves. Would you like to try, Eivor? There is a small price for the winner. Or are you not fast enough? Explain the race to me. Run along the lead pathway as fast as that old swine, Hermod. The first to do two laps wins. Where do I start? A <laughs> good sport, Eivor. You will start here. Run when the pig starts running. To raise the stakes and fun, I will join you too. Ready? <laughs> Try. Another victory for my saga. Seems your legs were blessed. Oh, no matter the winner, the joy was in the doing. Indeed. And we sure slice open Frankia's belly this time, eh? Now to feast on her entrails. The winnings are worthy of a serpent's lair. And the roads glistened from the dew of slaughter. Yes. Though, one wonders if such butchery was needed. No lessons today, Eivor. I doubt I will remember them. Listen to my words, Toka. Long after the bodies are buried and the house is rebuilt, the Franks will remember this day. All we have is an uneasy truce with Charles. And glory worthy of our ancestors. <laughs> you are hopeless. That is clear. I took a handsome sword to meet the fighting. Have it. A keepsake to remember this day by. You honor me. I will cherish the blade. By the way, I was glad you did not turn over Bernard. I miss Sinric, but a father like Charles is worse than no father at all. I could not doom the boy. It is not a price I think my clan would have me pay for their safety. <laughs> Ah, Eivor! Here is something even you have never done. Tossing food for sport. Cheese throwing? The most pungent game of them all. Nastier than Charles himself. You enjoy this? I prefer to eat the cheese, but who am I to question the games of the people? So, want to toss some cheese? How do I win this game? 
You need to throw at least two blocks of cheese past the green banner. Quite simple. Oh, and you have three tries to get it done. Will not hurt to try. Should be easy. <laughs> Just try not to hit anyone. Bravo, Evor! Oh, need to throw harder than that! Good throw, Evor! Never underestimate the cheese. Did I underestimate the... You definitely earned the prize, so here, some stray silver from the spoils of Paris. You expected a different outcome. I thought you best for rallying a siege and swinging a sharp stick. Was not sure how you would toss some cheese. There's much about me you don't know, Pierre. Oh, pray tell. What else should I know? Worry not about what I might teach. Right. Plenty to celebrate about this night. Don't let me spoil your fun. Go on. Something was a mess with Siegfried earlier. A little ale may have lifted his spirits by now. What if the Norns put the bump there for a reason? Huh. Eivor the Talker. Quite a trove of riches, Siegfried. What were you doing with Count Odo as Charles' army marched on me and my men? I was trying to gain his surrender. What of it? Is it not strange that you met with Odo, Richardis, even Charles himself, and yet all three still walk around with their heads? Everything I've done has been for my clan. It is curious that we must drench our blades in battle sweat to enjoy a night like this.
This celebration is not about us and those we killed. It is for our dead, so that we may honor them. <laughs> the Frankish blood, the feasting. I still feel nothing. I find no peace in any of it. You avenged your murdered people. You gained glory in their names. Is that why I did what I did? Vengeance and glory. I wonder anymore why any of us do the things we do. Is it Valhalla? Is it clan? Or maybe we grant ourselves reasons to go from one mead cup to the next. Maybe there are no reasons. And we are no different than wolves. Driven by some inner hunger we can never understand. That may be. But for the sake of our peoples, we must continue to act otherwise. No. I do not believe there is a hole waiting for us. This world is our hole. We get but one. I shall not pretend. Frankia's cup overflows with lush farmland, fat farmers and fatter purses. All the more for us to drink. Tomorrow, we quit this place and head south for greater bounties than even a king can grow. We gave Charles our word. Our word? You are the one who failed to return his son, Bernard. Have you forgotten? That was different. Charles would have... Fuck Charles! We spared Paris today, but tomorrow we march for Burgundy. And after that, all of Francia. I cannot let you do it, Siegfried. Then stop me. Will it be a Holmgang then, Wolfkist? I only ask that you honor your agreement. What does a cross starver like Charles know about honor? I owe him nothing. And he owes me everything. No amount of Frankish blood will bring Sinric or the others back. Some wrongs can never be made right. All this talk of right and wrong, honor, as if we can judge, it has no meaning. Can we explain all the blood on our hands, Eivor? Or are we two jesters on this Frankish stage, awaiting our final performance? Dry your weapon. If you want to find peace, this is not the way. We must build fresh bonds, look forward to something new. Look forward, look back. It is death in both directions. We are but a morning fog that will inevitably lift. Now answer my challenge or dishonor yourself! Your sorrow will linger if you do not face it directly. My blood, the blood of more Franks, will be no solve for your grief. It is as if you speak with Sinric's voice. 
I've been at sea with no stars to guide by since he died. And if your brother were here, what would be his counsel? To move forward. To live. My time here is over. My kin are dead. The ones who remain must decide what is right for themselves. Let it be Toka's time. What will you do? Leave this place. Ask different questions. Forget everything I know and... and find a new way. going away then I am going with him no Toga your clan needs you He was not himself since my father died. A solitary man. But never more so than when he stood alone, tasked with rousing our desperate clan. He led well, but all leaders must one day step aside. That, or see others die because they held on to power for too long. When his strong voice echoed in this place, we knew what to do. We had courage, daring. And his fire still burns in your folk. Skull. Skull. I lack a taste for mulled wine. Sometimes a leader must drink the thing they wish not to. I have word from Count Odo. What does he want? An audience with Eivor. It is urgent. He says the Queen may be in peril. My spies confirmed this. Shao has been hunting again for her and the boy. What do you think? Odo would not lie. He says it's urgent. I must go. I owe the Queen a debt, and I am honor-bound to see this through. Then go. You have fortune's favor, Wolfkist.
I take blessings as well. One little coin buys a fat block of cheese, but one little blessing might ensure I won't freeze. Ah, oh, God, please, have mercy on me, dear Father above.
Eivor of England. You sent for me. Said the Queen was in peril. I did. Come with me. Look at these workers. Working happily. Working with pride. The beauty of my family vineyard depends on them. The quality of the wine is their doing. They are not beasts of burden. They take as much pride in these grapes as I do. I'm not here to admire your vineyard. No. But this is more than a vineyard. It is a vision of Francia. A vision that cannot exist under Charles. Ah, pluck the grapes right on time, Roland. Très bien. Dependable as always. Merci, monsieur. These grapes produce the wine that my vineyard is famous for. I admit, there is an uncommon beauty to these lands. Hmm, <laughs> indeed. Come. I am slower than I once was. My physician says the wounds you have delivered should have taken me. You chose to have that fight. And you fought for your people and for your honor. I do not hold it against you. Any true leader would have done the same. We are more alike than we first appear, Eva. And I will carry the scars to I feared my message would not get past Siegfried's many axes. Siegfried has left these lands. Those axes belong to Toka Simenik's Dotir now. That should be cause for celebration. But I fear Toka is yet another devil in a male shirt. Toka has learned much from Siegfried. Some of what she has learned is how not to be. I hope you are right. Your message said Rishardis was in peril. Is that really why you sent for me? These men represent the growing rebellion against Charles the Fat. I now accept the bitter truth, that I find more honor and courage in you, Ivar, a northern invader, than in my own king. Honor is not bound by country or creed. Indeed. And it seems Richardis also knows this. She and that bastard Bernard are more than mere pawns in Francia's future. Bernard. A part of me wanted to hand him over to Charles. What grace you possess prevented you from condemning the boy to a hell in this world. He is better off with Richardis. Where is the Queen? She's hiding in a tavern in Amiens, guarded by my men. But those men have not reported back in... too long. I will find Richardis. I'm duty-bound to return the aid she once gave me. And... she is my friend. There is one more thing. This rebellion will succeed. And when it does, my path to the throne will be well charted. Your true ambitions. I was a loyal servant to Francia, to Charles, and to God. But Charles has been exposed. You want a Frankish king who will never march on England? I am that king. If I kill Charles for you. If you kill Charles for Francia, we would not forget. No. Murdering Charles on the hope it will bring security to my clan is not the kind of deal I mean to make. I misjudged you, Eva. You stand before your people's best hope. Enough. You offer a promise you cannot keep, Odo. I will go to the tavern in Amiens and find Richardis. Fine. Bonne chance, Eva. I will pray for you to succeed where my men have not.
Spread your wings, Sunan. See you, old friend. It was a massacre. Mon Dieu. Bodies scattered like children's toys. They say it was a demon. Some say the Queen, she... My, what vile witchery has befallen us. There's another Diablo now. We should go. Algerans, I demanded for this rolls and os these men must have been the Queen's guard. Tavern Keep, what happened here? Hide! I am not sure it has gone. The monster, so much blood. Just hide! Better to look around myself. Bobby. Yes, these are Odo's men. There is a dead monk upstairs, and a scroll in a tongue I do not understand. It's uh, probably scripture, written in Latin. The boy prince reads Latin. Bernard? Oh, yes, they were here. That monk was his teacher. He's from the church here in Amiens. I heard the queen tell Bernard to go to the priests and nuns there when he is in trouble. Then I will look in on this church, and hope to find the queen there. Celebrate! 
day, King Charles, great victory over the hidden chieftain they call Siegfried. Show your faith and loyalty to the crown by dressing in Amiens bleu. Garments at a discount. I saw the boy, I know it. The bastard princeling is around here somewhere. But not as here. What do you see, Zulim? Best not to draw attention here. Charles needs to do to the queen. I don't care if she's a witch or young. Nobody should be burned alive. Villa. But Richard Vies distracted him, and I snuck through the construction along the wall. There is a tower there, and if you climb and climb, you can go right over. Where is Richardus? Where is the Queen? The monster. She left with him. You mean the one who slaughtered so many at the tavern? He said we'd be brought to Father for something. A test. I was... What kind of test? I... He called it a trial. Yes, that is what he said. A trial by fire, at Father's villa, here in Amiens. He means to burn her alive. Go, Bernard. Go to your house in Lister. I will see to Shadis. I can help. I know things. You do not have to hurt my father. He is just... He gets confused sometimes. You must keep yourself safe, Bernard. The fate of Frankia depends on your survival. It will be a grand task for you to sneak all the way down to the Seine alone. This is a hero's burden. Are you up for it? I can do it. Good. Now go. Keep going, and do not look back. I will see to Richardis. Au revoir, Evo. Show me 